bigger the show, the better. That's how many feel about the 4th of July fireworks. But not everyone will sit out on the lawn and enjoy the show this holiday weekend. For some veterans, the loud noises can trigger post-traumatic stress disorder. WPTZ's Liz Streppa joins us live with the story. New tonight, Liz. Steph, those loud explosions certainly aren't for everyone, and that's why doctors are warning people to be cautious when it comes to setting off those fireworks this weekend. Jennifer Austin loves fireworks and the 4th of July. I know Memorial Day is sort of the kickoff to the summer, but this is really kind of the big bang, and not, no pun intended. She says growing up, her father put fireworks shows together, so she says it's only fitting that she sells them. So I get to see all these people that have made me so happy through our other seasons. And while putting on a colorful show in the sky is an American tradition when it comes to celebrating the 4th, the loud explosions can be traumatic for combat veterans. It's, it's a complicated time for veterans. Dr. Brett Rush from the VA Medical Center in White River Junction says those explosions can trigger symptoms of post traumatic stress disorder or PTSD. And sometimes that trigger can uh, manifest um, from things that will remind uh, a veteran of some of the experiences that they encountered while they were in combat. That's why this year you might see signs like these from military with PTSD.org in front of some homes. They read, Combat Veteran Lives Here. Please be courteous with fireworks. Dr. Rush says these signs are helping educate and spread awareness about PTSD. It, it sort of spreads the word um, and helps us all to become more aware of these struggles um, that veterans face. That's something Austin understands. She came from a military family. I honestly believe that it's a good idea. Um, I think people, knowing the circumstances, will be more than respectful. And she hopes it's something people keep in mind as they celebrate Independence Day. And Dr. Rush says if you have a neighbor who is a veteran and you're planning on setting off some fireworks this weekend, it might be a good idea to check in with them and let them know of your plans. In the Upper Valley Newsroom, Liz Strappa, WPTZ News Channel 5.